Well, this is a computer. So you know that the first rule of troubleshooting is, did you turn it off and turn it on again? It sounds cliche, but it works because all programs are impossibly dense and work on top of hardware platforms that are decades old. So one little byte randomly switches from one to zero, something somewhere may not work right. Use the power menu on the remote to restart device. Also, we may have already fixed the bug that you're experiencing. So if you have internet access, go to system to download system update and select it to download the solution. Incidentally, that power menu has all sorts of useful features on it. Think of it as a lower level brain for your Geochron if everything else is misbehaving. If your Geochron is a bit laggy, it may be trying to do too much at once. To improve this, go to the system menu under optimizations, turn off unlimited layer downloads, this reduces the server downloads to just the live layers that are being displayed, not all of them, all the time. When it's on, you get all the live layers downloaded all the time, and it slows the computer down. Then, turn on auto maintenance. At about 1 a.m. every night, the Geochron will run a system check from memory and reboot itself. It takes a minute and will improve the performance of your Geochron, especially the older ones, if your live layers are not loading, or if your premium tab is empty, you may not have internet access. Look to the top of the system tab at the internet status. If it says disconnected, you're disconnected. Live layers won't work anymore because we're always sending the most current data to your Geochron over the internet. If the up, down, left, right buttons on your remote are misbehaving or not working at all, you may be in cursor mode. This button on your remote turns it into a mouse on the screen. You'll know this because there'll be a little cursor that begins in the center of the screen where it doesn't belong, and your remote will not do much of anything. Press the arrow button again to turn it off. Try repairing the remote to the dongle on the unit. Contact us for instructions on how to do that. And if it still doesn't work, check your batteries. These suggestions cover a lot of troubleshooting cases in our experience, but not all of them, so we answer email. Send an email to support at geocron.com, and you can expect a reply back within one business day. With that email, do us a favor and give us your software serial number. You can find it here and here.